Hello, hello. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. How are you doing today? Hello, good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Welcome back. Welcome back. Are you ready for your English class? Yeah, we're ready. We're ready. Okay. Yes. All right. That's great. That's great. I'm happy to see that everybody's back. I hope that you all had a very good weekend. Did everybody, was everybody able to advance on your platform? Yes, teacher. Okay, that's great. Yes. That's great. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Uh, did anybody have any, uh, ask any questions in regards to the activities or any questions in regards to the meaning of some words or pronunciation or something like that? Anybody? In my case, uh, I don't have, I don't have questions. Okay. Thank you, George. Thank you, George. Anybody else? No. Nobody? Nobody? Okay. Okay. Uh, Nubia, what section are you on? Okay, thank you. Uh, Yancy, what section are you on? Finish three. Oh, you finished section three. That's great. That's great. Thank you. Uh, Norma, what section are you on? Medium section three. Oh, okay. The middle of section three. Very good. Thank you. Uh, Maria, what section are you on? Uh, Maria, what section are you on? Your microphone's on silence. Okay. Uh, Lisbeth Wesso, what section are you on? <laughs> Okay, okay, excellent, excellent. Beginning number three, very good. Uh, Jocelyn, what section are you on? In section three. Section three, excellent. Yes. Uh, Jose Luis, what section are you on? We have the teacher, I finish uh, the first and second. Okay, okay, good, good. Okay. Thank you. All right, well, looks like uh, everybody, almost everybody is already finished section one and two. At this moment, does anybody have any questions in regards to sections number one and number two? Any questions about the activities in sections number one and number two. I don't have a question because I understand the uh, only topic. Okay, very good, very good. Since nobody has any questions in regards to sections number one and number two, I would like for us to go ahead and move forward and continue working on section number three. All right. Okay, let's look at section number three and we're going to be looking at, they are perfect for you conversation. They are perfect for you. The top understand is the going audio. to be, what is your neighborhood? What is your neighborhood like? For this question, you can say, for example, my neighborhood is quiet. Uh, my nay 
for hood is palm. My neighborhood is safe. All right. So these are examples of how you can describe your neighborhood. Everybody listen and repeat. What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood, What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? My neighborhood is quiet. My neighborhood is quiet. My neighborhood is calm. My neighborhood is calm. My neighborhood is safe. My neighborhood is safe. So these are just some examples of, of how you can answer the question, what is your neighborhood like? Now, at this moment, we are going to watch a video. And in the video, we are going to be listening to a conversation of two people describing their neighborhood. Let's listen. Listen and take notes. As much as possible. Remember, you may access to this conversation as many times as needed. I recommend for you to take notes while you are listening. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about demonstratives while shopping. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. These red ones? I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these? Hmm, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? That blue one right there. How much is it? It's $42. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Which one? That blue All right. Who can tell me what are the demonstratives in this conversation? What are the demonstratives? I guess they, these, and very, those. Very good, very good. Jocelyn, those, esos, those, uh, these, estos, these. What's the other one? That. That, very good. That, that, that. All right. There. Where? There. There. No, no, there is not a demonstrative. That is referring to a place. There. Mm -hmm. And the other one is, that's it. Those, these, and that. Repeat. Those. Those, those, these, 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 and that. And that. And that. And that. And that. that. Okay. Listen to the video, please. And we are going to be learning how to use the demonstratives in a sentence. Listen, please. Blue one right there. How much is it? Repeat. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. Oh, oh, oh look, look at, at those, those earrings, earrings, Maria. earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. They're, They're perfect, perfect for, you. for you. These red ones. These red ones. Red ones. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not, not sure. sure. No, not sure. no, the yellow ones. No, no, no the yellow, no, ones. yellow ones. Oh, these. Oh, oh these. these. Hmm. Yellow isn't really a good color for me. 
Well, that necklace isn't bad. Well, well, well that necklace isn't bad. bad. Which one? Which, Which one? one? Which one? Which one? The blue one right there. The blue one right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. How much is it? How, How much, much is it? Is it? It's forty two dollars. It's forty two dollars. That's expensive. That's, that's, that's expensive. expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. Hey, hey let, let me get, me get, it, get it, it for you. you. It's your birthday present. It's, it's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. All right. At this moment, do you have any questions in regards to the pronunciation or the meaning of these vocabulary words? Questions about the pronunciation or the meaning of these words? I, I got a question, Trisher. Yes. Oscar, what is your question? Uh, the difference, uh, I don't know, is between one and ones. Ah, very good. If I am referring to one, it's singular. That one, ese. That oh, okay. one, it's singular. But if I say those ones, then I am referring to plural, plural noun. Like, like yeah, earrings. That is plural. Plural nouns. Those ones, those earrings, those shoes, those pants, those t shirts. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Okay. Another question. Good question. Another question. Teacher, the pronunciation. Yes, Jenny. Neck, neck, well, ah, yes, yes, yes. Good, good. Necklace. Necklace. Very good. Necklace. Thanks. Necklace. Good, good. Another question? Okay. Teacher. Hi. Uh, pronunciation the this and this. Ah, very good. La diferencia. Yes. These, these, it has more like a zzz sound. These, these, like when you have a B, a B. These, these. And then this is more like a S, right? This, this. These, this, this, these, this, this. Good question. Another question? Thank you. Yes, of course. Another question? Okay. Now, what I would like for you to do is you are going to work in pairs and I want you to practice the conversation. I'm going to allow you to share your screen. Voy a permitir que puedan compartir sus pantallas. You're going to work in pairs. Va a trabajar con una pareja. And you are going to practice this conversation. Va a practicar esta conversación. One student is going to be Steve. And the other student is going to be Maria. And then vice versa. You're going to change roles. Any questions? No, I don't question. No. Okay, okay. Uh, this conversation is over here in the platform on section 3.1, conversation. 
they are perfect for you. You can share the screen. I already activated the possibility for you to share your screen with your classmates. You are going to have five minutes, five minutes so that you can practice the conversation with your partners. This is a speaking conversation pronunciation practice activity. Ready? Let's go. I'm going to send you the activity so that you can practice the pronunciation. Oh, thank you. I see Danny already did it. Thank you, Danny. Uh, Norma, Elizabeth, Alexandra, I don't see that you went with your partner. So I see that Alejandra, Elizabeth, you did not go with your group. And also Lucel Bonilla, I see that you didn't go with your group. And I see that Norma didn't go with her group. All right, Norma, I see you have bad connection. Yancy is over here. And Julio Cesar. And I'll put you over here. Uh, maybe it's the internet connection. Sometimes it's the internet connection that doesn't give you the possibility for you to connect. So we're just going to bring everybody back. Okay, since I see that some people cannot enter the group, we're just going to practice together. Uh, let me have Jenny and Norma. Mm -hmm. Jenny, I want you to be Steve. And Norma, I want you to be Maritza. Okay. Okay. Oh, look, the uh, dust earring, Maria. They're perfect for you. These red ones. I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these. Mm, yellow is really a good color for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. With me, the blue one right there. How much is it? It is forty-two dollars. That's expensive. Hey, let me get let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday! Hi, right. good work. Good pronunciation. Thank you. Okay, let Jenny go ahead and select another partner and Yancy select another partner. No sé si está Julio. Who? Julio Alfaro. Julio Alfaro. Can you hear me, Julio Alfaro? Sí, aquí estoy. Okay. So you are going to be Steve. Jonathan Flores. All right, Jonathan Flores. Sure, madam. All right, Jonathan Flores, you are going to be Maria. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Okay, ready, go.
Can you see my screen? Yes. All right, go ahead. You can begin. Uh, can I start? Yes, you may. Waiting on you. Okay. Oh, look at uh, those earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. I think that the other person is not ready. So who was the other person that was going to read? Hello. I, if you want, I, I can. All right. Okay, go ahead. Ready, you can get started. Uh, yo? Okay. Yes, you are okay. Steve. Muy bien. Oh, look at those those earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. These red ones? I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these? Um, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? The blue one right there. How much is it? It's $42. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. All right. Excellent work. Good pronunciation. Very good. Thank, Thank you, George. You. Thank you. Thank you OK, uh, go ahead, George select the next person and Jonathan select the next person. Uh, Yancy, Melanie. Norma. All right, Norma, you are going to be Steve and Yancy will be Maria. Okay. Ready, go. You may begin. You can start. Can you see my screen? Can you see my screen? Yeah, teacher. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Go. Uh, Yancy, Melanie, and the other person is... Norma, pero Norma era Steve. Okay, go ahead. Norma, you are Steve. What normal matter? Uh, I think it's Norma Elizabeth. Oh, okay. I see. Yes. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They are perfect for you. These red ones. I'm not sure. No, the yellow one. Oh, this mm, yellow isn't really a good color for me. We oui, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? That's blue, all right? There. How much is this? It's $42, that's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Excellent, very good. All right, guys, does anybody have any questions in regards to the pronunciation, in regards to the meaning? 
of the words. Okay. Now, for your homework, what you're going to do is you're going to... It's $42. That's expensive. You're going to come over here and you're going to do... Uh, you're going to add a post right here. Add a post. And then over here, you're going to, where it says title, you're going to put shopping for a birthday present. And then here, you're going to create a similar conversation like this conversation. For example, uh, you can say, uh, this one could be mom. Mom says, hey, look at those shoes over there. And then you say, which ones, the blue ones or the red ones? And then your mom says, your mom says, I like, I like the blue ones. And then you say, I don't like those. I prefer the red ones. And then you, your mom says, how much are those? And then you say, those are $125. They are Jordans, right? Or something like that. It can be about shoes, and then you have to go to submit, submit. And then we will be able to look at your work over here. Now, the homework, it can be about shoes. It can be about clothes. It can be about food, a restaurant. It could be about a book, a movie, whatever. Whatever topic, shopping for a laptop, shopping for a video game, whatever. Oh, do you understand? Questions? Yes. yes, I do. Yes. Questions? Questions? Yes. Questions? 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 Okay. Now, that's going to be your homework. For the next activity, we're going to be reviewing the next section which is demonstratives. We're going to listen to the video and I would like for you to take notes so that after the video, we can do some examples. Ready, let's go. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to use demonstrative pronouns, this, these, that, those, to express possible choices. Hello, this is what we're going to do. We will listen to the audio program first, try to follow the topic, and as soon as it is done, we will talk about it. Demonstratives. One, ones. How much is this necklace? How much is this one? How much is that necklace? How much is that one? Which one? All right. Let's look at this one right here. 
how much notice right here it says is and over here it says how much are is and are who can tell me what is the difference between using how much is and how much are? What is the difference? In the first case I, is singular, singular and plural. And singular, yes, singular and plural. Yeah. Very good, very good. So on this one, it is singular noun. And on the second one, it is plural now. Is that correct? Is That's that correct? Right. Very good. Thank you. Very good. So the difference of when I say, when I use this and these, the difference is that this and this one is singular. These and these is plural, okay? So when I use this and these, I am referring to an object that is close to me. Si el objeto está cerca de ti, usas this or these, si estás cerca de ti. If it's not, if it's over there, you say that, that necklace, and that one, or those earrings, or those, right? Esos, when they are over there. Okay, look at the difference. Is distance. Do you understand? Yes. Yes, okay. yes I got it. Okay, that's the idea. Let's continue. One. The blue one. It's $42. How much are these earrings? How much are these? How much are those earrings? How much are those? Which ones? The yellow ones. They're $18. Prices. $42. $59.95 or $59.95. As you realized, we're talking about demonstrative pronouns. As you know, there are four. This, these, that, those. I know you have studied this before, so we will make a quick review. This, singular, near. These, plural, near. That, singular, far. All right. Does anybody have any questions about this vocabulary? Questions about this vocabulary? No. Near? What is the meaning of near? No. Cerca. Okay. Cerca. What about, what is the meaning of far? Lejos. 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 All right. So we Lejos. use this and these when the object is near. And we use that and those when the object is far. Let's continue. Those, plural, far. Therefore, we use is for this and that and are for these and those. All right, so is, is for, what do I use is for? Singular. 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 And what do I use are? Plural. 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 Correct. All right, let's, let's finish. In English, we use one or once very often when talking about choosing or having more than one option. For example, I ask, is that your car? Which one? The red one or the blue one? The red one. Yes, it is. 
the words one or ones always go at the end of the question and answers, and they replace the noun in question. Okay. Now, right now, what we're going to do is we're going to take the attendance. So I would like for everybody to say present if you are present when I call your name. All right, when I say your name, please say present. Okay, all right. Give me one second. I'm looking for the for the sheet. All right, there it is. All right, Alexandra Lissette. Present. Today is the 23rd, present. Okay, thank you. Jocelyn Yanira. Present. Present. Josia Alexiomar. Present, present. Awesome. Jonathan Joshua. Present. Flores, all right. George Alberto. Here I am, teacher. Excellent. Jose Enrique. Present. Thank you. Jose Luis. I, got, I, uh, I, I I hear. Okay, I like that. I like that. Jose Oscar. I am here, teacher. Very good. Julio Cesar Alfaro. Presenta, teacher. All right. Julio Cesar Capos. Here. Lisbeth. Stephanie Hueso. Present. All right. Marcela Alejandra. Absent. Marcela Alejandra. Absent. Okay. Maria Elizabeth. Maria Elizabeth Morataya. Absent. Okay. Present. Present. Oh, okay. Couldn't hear you. All right. Merin Daniela. Present teacher. All right. Good. Nelson Adan. Present teacher. All right. Norma Beatrice. Lisano. Oh, that one would be Hernandez. Norma Beatrice Hernandez. Absolutely. Huh? Igual que yo. Ahí está. Norma Beatriz Hernández. Ah, Norma Beatriz Hernández. There it is. Okay, I got it. Okay, I got you. Thank you. Uh, Norma Elizabeth Callejas. Present. All right. Norma Elizabeth. Norma Elizabeth Callejas. Present. Okay. Uh, Norma Elizabeth Lizano. 
Novia Christina. Okay. Eh. Eh, Oscar Alexander, puede mantener el micrófono en silencio, por favor. Present. Okay, thank you. All right. Oscar Rolando. Oscar Rolando. En el chat justo present teacher. Oh, let me see. Okay, Oscar Orellana, present. Okay, I see you. Thank you. Oscar Rolando Orellana, very good. Okay. Eh, Reina Concepción. Present. Okay. Ronald Roberto. Present teacher. Excellent. Salvador Galdames. Salvador Galdames. Absent. Okay. Absent. Sandra Guadalupe. Sandra Guadalupe. Is absent? Is present. Very good. Sylvia Lisette. Present. Thank you. Susanna Isabel. Present, teacher. Very good. Yancy Melanie. Present. Okay. Jenny Carolina. Jenny Carolina. Present. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. So that's everybody. Uh, Salvador Galdames absent. Uh, let me see. This one is Marcela Alejandra absent. And that's it. Good job, guys. Thank you. All right. Now, for this activity, for the following activity, what I would like for us to do is we are going to take a look at using the demonstratives. And for the demonstratives, you are going to give me five sentences. Cinco oraciones. Five sentences, cinco oraciones. I want you to write the five examples here in the discussion forum at the post. Five examples using this. We're talking about the most pronouns. As that, you know, there are four. This, these, that, those. Any questions? I know you have. Not sure. Any questions? Not too sure. What no. are you going to do? What are you going to do? We're going to write five examples using demonstratives. Correct. Correct. I am going to activate so that you can share your screen and you can work in pairs. You will have five minutes. Five minutes. Ready? Let's go. All right, uh, Jose Luis, Norma, Susanna, 
Nelson, Jose Enrique, uh, Sandra Guadalupe, Norma Beatrice. You didn't go to your with your partner. Huh? You didn't go with your partner? Uh, Norma Elizabeth, Jose Enrique, Norma Beatriz, Lucel Bonilla, Oscar Oriana. Uh, las voy a mandar otra vez. Norma Elizabeth, le volví a mandar la solicitud. Oscar Oriana, le volví a mandar la solicitud. Norma Elizabeth, le volví a mandar la solicitud. Eh, José Enrique. José Enrique. Oscar Oriana. Reina Concepción. Oscar Alejandro. Siempre me saca todo. Ah, pues sí, debe de ser su internet. Ah, pues trabaje aquí con el grupo que está acá. José Enrique, okay. Oscar Oriana, Luz del Bonilla, Norma Beatriz, Julio Alfaro. ¿Me escuchan? Yes. Sí, sí, oye. Ok, you can share your screen and you can work as a group. Yes. Ok, entonces sería how much is this bike? No, tenemos que decir esta o esta. Porque si está cerca, uh -huh. eh, tendría que ser si es solo una bicicleta, tendría que ser this. This. Sí, sí. Uh -huh, porque está cerca, ¿verdad? Sí. Pero si está lejos sería des. Ajá, entonces lo ponemos con dis o con des. Cerca o lejos. Pueden ser los dos para tener diferentes. Va, entonces pongamos esos zapatos, uh -huh. das shoes, and this bike. Está bien. This bike. Eh, otra podría ser eh, eh, quiero ver qué otra podríamos hacer eh, por ejemplo I like this this table this table mm -hmm. this table This or this? This. This. Porque sería singular. Una mesa. Esta. Porque está cerca. Pero si está... Eh, si está cerca, dijo que era das. Si la teníamos aquí, estábamos cerca de ella. Pero si estábamos lejos... Era dos. Era singular, eh, eh, perdón, this. Puede ser, uh, oh, oh much is, is that. Entonces, that está cerca, la mesa. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I like that table. table. Sí. That table. Eh, eh, otra... I like this food. This how much is uh, uh, for the third dust. Um, 
Apples. Manzanas. Mm -hmm. How much is y lo usamos lejos? Dos, das, das, dos, 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 ¿verdad? Dos, apple. Vale, nos falta una. Eh, podríamos poner. I like, no, o, a ver, what do you like, what do you like, um, no, no, eso no, um, Como... Oh, bueno. Siempre usamos... I like, I like dos, dos, mm. orange, igual, orange, orange. Oh, mm -hmm. much is, is. All right, let me have Julio Cesar Campos. Let me hear your examples, please. Okay, teacher. Uh, I like that shirt. Uh, I like those pants. This house is big. This apple is sweet. And that, uh, that uh, tree is bigger than this one. Perfect. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Excellent, Julio. Julio, select another participant, please. Uh, Reina Concepción. Reina Concepción. Reina Concepción. Yes. All right. Um, Let me hear your examples. Yes. Um, this is my new shirt. These dogs are fun. Oh, sorry about that. Le puse silencio porque no la escuchamos. Se escucha la tele. Sorry about that. Reina, can you hear me? Okay. Go ahead, Reina. Continue. This is my new shirt. These cats are funny. The car is fancy. Those shoes are very tall. Excellent. Excellent. Good job. Thank you. Let me have a uh, Josia Alexiomar. Josia Alexiomar. Yes. Uh, Reina logró en regresar. Reina había publicado en el chat que la sacó la plataforma. No sé si regresó. Reina. Ah, oh, okay. Thank you, Reina. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Thank you. Eh, let me have. I'm here. Okay, go ahead. The first, this is my car. The second, those are my new friends. The third, that car is very old. The four, this is her book. The five, these are my sister. Perfect. Perfect. These are my sisters. Perfect. Okay. I see that everybody understands this topic. Let's go ahead and move forward. And we're going to be looking at section number 3.4. 3.4. For section number 3.4, we're going to look at the knowledge check, which is shopping. You're going to look at the images and complete the conversations using the demonstratives. Did everybody finish this activity? ¿Todos terminaron esta actividad o todavía no? 
No, yes. Not yet. I finished. No. Yes. Not yet. Okay, we're going to work in pairs. Para los que no lo han hecho. Y los que ya lo hicieron, you can help los que no lo han hecho. Ready? Okay. Let's yes. change groups. Let's go. Si ya lo hizo, puede compartir su pantalla presionando el botón verde abajo que dice compartir. Y puedes ayudarle a tus compañeros. Uh, the people that couldn't, uh, Jenny Carolina, Norma Beatriz, Lucel Bonilla, Oscar Orellana, Perin Daniela, can you hear me? Norma yes, Elizabeth, can. can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, you can work. Uh, yes. as, you can work as a group. Uh, you can work with Norma Beatriz, uh, Lucel Bonilla, Oscar Orellana. You can share your screen. Uno puede compartir la pantalla. Okay, ahorita. Hello, Nelson Adan. Hello, hello. Your partner is talking to you. Can you speak? Can you speak? Or only chat. Oh, okay. Only chat. All right, good job, good job. Good, good job, Julio Cesar, excellent. Good. Excellent work, Julio Cesar, good, thank you. Good, good work, good, Elizabeth. Good, Lisbeth. Good, good, Susana. Good, Marie Daniela, very good. Yeah. All right, guys, it looks like everybody is finished. So we're going to go ahead and check it together. Uh, Norma Elizabeth, number one, please. My Aquí estoy compartiendo are those mm -hmm. jeans? How much are those no. jeans? Very good. Uh, Norma Beatriz Hernandez. ¿Sí? All right, which ones do you mean these? One. Good, good. Uh, go ahead, continue for me, Julio Cesar. Uh, A and B. Um, B, Julio Cesar Campos. Uh, Julio Cesar Campos, correct, you. Okay. Uh, once. Once, okay. Yes. MB? MB, oh, uh, they, they are. They. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good. Uh, let me have Maria Elizabeth, number two. Hey. 
I like the backpack over there. How much is it? Is it good? Good. Uh, Lisbeth Wesso, the next one. Which one? The red? One. One. Very good. Thank you. Yancy Melanie, letter B. It's twenty-seven fifty, but the green. But the green. But the green. All right, the green one. Very good. Thank you. All right, all right, guys. See you tomorrow. Please continue working on the platform. Good night. Bye. Bye.